that's another reason, you know, niggas, you know, especially in this city of Richmond, you know, they don't want uh, to tell other people about somebody else because they so scared that another person is going to take off. However, when you got loyal people in your group, you know what I mean? And to give you an example, like I seen 50 and Floyd on this magazine, you know what I mean, both of them holding you know, a lot of money or whatever. They don't mind sending fans back and forth because you don't lose that fan base. You know what I mean? This is like, bro, I told him whenever he's ready to do whatever he, he feels in his heart, he can excel at. Um, okay, I, I've already introduced him. Everybody know he's my little brother. He has some shit on my videos. You know what I mean? I'm in some shit of his. Show him, bro. Show him yourself. And, you know, this, I ain't never been the type of nigga that been like, you know, scared to put my niggas on. I mean, like, if you look at the Kush boys, man, for real, them niggas don't need me. You know what I mean? They was already rich when I met them. Super rich. They already had their business on lock. They don't need me, man. You know what I mean? And, you know, uh, but I like what they doing. You know what I'm saying? I like their products. I like their drive. I like their inspiring things that they say. So, any chance that, you know, I get, I'm going to salute them brothers, man. I'm going to shout them out. You know what I mean? I ain't asking them for shit. I sent products over there. You know what I mean? It ain't about begging or nothing. It's about being true to who yourself, who you are yourself and helping others, man. You know what I mean? Regardless of what level they on. Because at some point, man, you know, you know they're going to be like, you know what? This dude is real, man. You know what I mean? He ain't never asked us for shit. You know what I mean? It ain't like I'm like, yeah, man, Kush Boys, this, Kush Boys, that. And then calling them niggas. Man, look, I said your name. Can I get a few dollars? I don't do that, man. I got my own everything. We wear our own clothes. We got our own homes. You know what I'm saying? Look at this shit, man. Keep on raw squirrel. Bruh, keep on raw squirrel. I mean, you know what I mean? And I keep my name on. I hate this sucker. Said he looking for me. Bruh, ain't hard to find. I mean, you know what I mean? Raw squirrel clothes. Ain't but a couple of niggas in this game. You know, they, they, got, they got my shit on. You know what I mean? And I love that niggas think a certain way about my shit because that means they won't try to duplicate the word. You can't duplicate it because... I mean, this shit raw squirrel, man. Everybody know my shit when they see it. You know what I mean? Shout out to my uh, cousin Biz, you know what I mean? He down here from Philly. You know what I mean? He going back home tomorrow. You know what I mean? We be up there in less than two weeks, man. Real, that's real rap. You know what I mean? And um, shit, it's a rap, man. I've, 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 learned, I've learned one thing doing this video shit. You know what I mean? This entertainment shit about the power of numbers. Shout out to my mom. My mom got a PhD in math. I always outdo niggas. I don't care what it was. When I was hustling, I outdid niggas. When I was selling, aggressively just basically doing real estate and loans, I outdid niggas. And now, you can check my numbers now. Can't no, it, bruh, there's nobody that's been in this thing three years who can see me, you know what I mean, what I, what I do. And then another thing is, like I said, I said the trend. Nobody was doing this, uh, you know, uh, 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 documenting their life. You know what I mean? Nobody was doing it. I mean, you got other niggas copying that, but they can't even catch up. But one thing I can say is this. All, everything I did came out of showing love. You know, if you look at all my super pages, one thing you'll notice, man, niggas try to hit on me. Look, I pay that shit no man, bro. You know what I mean? You a lame. Pay you up some man for what? Nigga, you broke, motherfucker. You ain't got nothing, man. For real, man. Let's, let's, let's be real about the situation. You broke. You know what I mean? You broke. And, I mean, shit working over here. You know what I mean? If I ain't got no money, it's just probably because I couldn't get two now. However, that don't mean I can't get nobody to bring me now. And, bro, I tell you, everybody tell you about me. I spend money with people who ain't never did shit for me or, for real, who niggas who tight. You know what I mean? Because one thing about it, two things for certain, I can create, I can generate some income. You know what I mean? I get like three, four hundred at least request a day for people to, to make clothes for people. If I'm that broke, fuck it, I make a shirt for $100. That's nothing. Am I right or wrong, bro? That's nothing. I can make a shirt for a ball. I can make I can make 20 of them today. You know what I mean? That's that's two grand. I can do that right now. I go on. That's, I, I mean, so many people hit me up. I mean, I love Ross Squirrel, but I ain't got two, $300 for a T-shirt. Can you make me one for $100? And I turn the money down. So money ain't shit when you got this kind of talent. Especially when you got, if you got 120,000 people watching you a day, bro, it ain't hard to get 100 of them to buy your products. You feel me? For real. And that's real rap. Fuck what the next nigga say. Fuck what he talking about. Let's see your numbers. If you all that sweet, I mean, you, you know what I mean? You is who you say you is. 
You know what I mean? You know how, bro, niggas be like, man, ones of this, ones of that. All right. We don't have to argue, man. Let's see your numbers and let's see mine, goddammit. For real. With all this talking back and forth, we don't do nothing but get mad, somebody get hurt. If I'm such a lame and you so sweet, let's see your numbers and let's check mine. Because Google don't lie. Oh, they gonna, Google gonna lie for me. Come on, man. Bro, the last two days, first day, I average about 90,000 views a day. Day for Christmas Eve, nigga, I hit 125. Yesterday was Christmas, I hit 118. That's in two days, man. A quarter million people watch me in two days. And I ain't never paid a dime to market my page. Come on, man. You got more, you got people out here, like Lady Gaga and people like that who, you know, they doing, you know, they got a billion hits on YouTube. But they got massive companies marketing their shit. They spending millions on, 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 on marketing. Bro, I ain't never, here to tell you, I ain't never spent a penny. Any way I ever marketed anything I do, I came up with a creative idea to do it. And you can't, you can't, you can't fuck with the fuck what a nigga say. How much money that bullshit you talking bring you, nigga? Cause we eating over here, nigga. And I'm ready to do it. But I, I tell you this, nigga. My mama ain't scrambling. We keep a house full of food. We got the best liquor in the house. You know what I mean? Am I lying, bro? Everything in that motherfucking house. Everybody, nigga. You see, should have seen under my fucking Christmas tree for Christmas. You want no bullshit under there? You ain't seen no motherfucking socks and none of that old. You know what I mean? Playing cards. Uno. No, man. On number real shit, you know what I mean? Able. Yeah, and we get money over here. So to the haters and lames and suckers, man, miss me with the bullshit, you know what I mean? Damn niggas gonna call my phone with the bullshit, you know what I mean? That's cool.